My throat is lacquered with some sort of tea-flavored concoction, and I am ready for lemmings. I'm around the wheel, and you're watching Pima Limbs, and we're going to continue with the extra levels. As long as I, uh, as long as I fail to figure out that one hurricane level, that how to prevent a mass suicide, then uh, we're going to be doing extra levels as a distraction in the meantime. And today we are on chili lemmings. 20 lemmings, I can only kill one, and uh, that looks, well, that looks fairly straightforward. I mean, uh... As long as, uh, as long as we're able to bash all the way through the walls, we might be going through the roof or something. It could get a little weird. When does it not get a little weird around here? Let's see. We've got, <laughs> yep, one basher. So, yeah, so there's the one blocker. Uh, this is a very kind of awkward angle to get up in there. So, and we can't go underneath because of water. So, we're going to have to find a way, methinks, to get up and over and we have to mine our way through to the end. Yeah, this shouldn't be too hard. Uh, let's. What's the release rate like? Twenty-five. Okay, let's see what that. Let's see what that does. Can you? Let's see if we can get through. Build at this little nook right here. Let's see if we can build without having him die. Maybe. Yeah, he should be able to patch that up. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so yeah. Let's start building uh, kind of up and out. Let's go Let's go outward one bridge. And then that should be able to get us like right up in here. Here would be the ideal bashing point. Uh, I think we can make it from about... Yeah, as long as we make him a builder right there. Let's go ahead and now... I may have made that a little too shallow, I think. That, that might be... Unideal. I should have started from a little farther up. That's why I made him build the whole bridge, so he would start from a little bit farther up. Yeah, that's going to get uh, pretty disgustingly bad. Yeah, yeah, no, no. But I have the general idea. Oh, yeah, that's going to be beautiful right there. That's pretty much perfect and dead on. Okay, so now we just got to go all the way to the end here. And we got to figure out where is the best spot to mine from. I think it's going to be probably from about right here that we need to start mining. So this is kind of like a, this is kind of like that through the roof level, I think, from Dove Limbs, except a little less complicated, uh, a little less complex, and a little bit easier to figure out that you're supposed to go through the roof. You obviously can't go through four thin ice pillars like that. So whereabouts would be the spot? I think right here. Right under, right above this little uh, snow titty right here. So let's go ahead and go ahead and wait for him to turn around. Because then that, that just gets messy right there. And the last thing we want is a mess. And uh, maybe I should have had them. How's the walking situation going to look here? I think we're going to cut in right next to. I think I did pretty good on determining where to cut from. Oh, maybe, I hope. Am I just barely too far off? I don't think so. Yeah, they're right. Oh, wow. If I had gone just like a pixel forward, it would have spelled it would have spelled bad news bears. Okay, so he is the farthest behind one. And I think he can make that walk probably in a minute 40 something. They're all kind of spaced apart from each other, just kind of walking and thinking about their own things. Lovely little couple right there. If Lemmings knew how to hold hands, if you if love wasn't such a futile pursuit for lemmings then those two would be holding hands right now i know i know for sure i feel confident in my heart of hearts about that lemming love it's a beautiful thing when it lasts longer than you know a few minutes or so so let's get in there and nuke them and that's our 95 percent good job blocker very good that was that was not too hard to figure out uh that was not too hard to figure out from a logistical standpoint you didn't have very much working against you there that was that was that was pretty simple that's the kind of lateral thinking that might trip up somebody who is only playing lemmings for the first time but <coughs> <coughs> as accustomed as i am to the weird stuff yeah that definitely is more of an extra like like tail end of calm type of level yeah good stuff good stuff still still I, I don't think i think pio is a little hard on himself i think it's not as lame as he uh says it is dark valley 80 lemmings gotta save 87 percent and there is a lot of land to work with here that is one thing that kind of trips me up when there is a lot of 
land to work with. It's that that makes it harder to narrow down where the spots to work with are. But this might be kind of a more straightforward get him to the exit like mayhem steelworks type of level. I don't know. We should see. We have six minutes to do it. That probably means we're going to be using most, if not all, of those six minutes. 80 lemmings, 87% to be saved. That's like, uh, I could probably kill somewhere in the name. 90% would be 72. 80% would be 64. So I could probably kill somewhere like 70. 70 probably is the, we should probably do our best to keep it around 10 lemmings that we kill. Maybe that probably, let's see, 80 minus 10 is 70. And I'm revealing once again how terrible I am at math. Yeah, that's probably about right. About 10 lemmings. Let's see. Let's see what we got here. We got no digger. This is a long, a long and dark valley indeed. So I think a majority of the building is going to be probably right here. It's going to take a few bridges to get up there and get safe. That way we could just bash through and then build up. We got 10 builders and no diggers. That's right. That's right. That's right. No digging allowed. So we're going to be bashing through this or we're going to be bashing through this maybe because you can't mine through here. You only get one miner. So we're going to have to save that miner for right here. So the four bashers are going to be right here. Uh, probably right here. That's going to be scary. Uh, oh, that's gonna get that's gonna get real ugly real fast. Uh, can he make? Th oh, he's gonna he's gonna like dip out. That's gonna be ooh. That's gonna be awkward. That's gonna be tough. Ooh, I don't know. I don't know how much I like that. Let's go ahead and uh, let's go ahead and let's start uh, building our way out though. Let's go ahead and uh, where is the proper angle? Maybe from like right right close to the entry hatch. But uh, yeah, of course, make it hard. Of course, that's. Well, it's not really it's not really making it hard in Lim Mini. That would have been really tough in regular old PC broke lemmings. But here it's a super easy task because of contingencies planned out aforehand. Like the little the little left right walker. Yeah, that's good stuff for man, then I cannot I cannot even probably count the number of times that that feature has saved my bacon. That's it's just so good. I'm probably going to have to use a builder right here to make this not so awkward. But first, let's concentrate. Let's let's uh let's let's uh focus first. Let's uh let's not let's not count all our eggs before they hatch. Let's first things first. Let's let's work on getting out of here. And I think I think I'll be able to do it. Uh this is really shady right here. I might end up I may have come just a smidge too close right here, but we can kill a few lemmings. It's not the worst thing on the planet. And all right, made it out. Okay, so I'm gonna need to, I'm gonna need to uh, separate these guys here. Maybe not build with one of these so much. Well, actually, that might help because they'll all sneak by because they're really close to him. So, okay, but anyway, they're spaced out far enough apart. It doesn't really matter. So I'm going to get, go ahead and come out, everybody. From here, we can start blocking things up. So we have a blocker, a bomber. Okay. Um, actually, it might be that he wants us to go from here. Actually, yeah, let's blow through here so we're not bothering with bashing and all that, all that trifling business. Uh, where's the best place to go from here? Probably like right here. Five, four... Probably, you don't have to strictly use a walking bomber right there, but I'm sure... Well, yeah, I, okay, yeah, that was pretty That was pretty amazingly good. So, that actually works to our favor. Yeah, let's get everybody crammed up in this little... Uh, there we go. All right, so now getting out of here should be a pretty easy task. Uh, assuming I don't actually blow the hell out of my bridge right here. So, let's go ahead and... How many bridges do we have? Well... Okay, yeah, this is going to get a little bit shaky from here. We're going to have just enough bridges, I think, to pull this off. But here is where we got a mine from. Okay, so now uh, probably from about this little nook right here, I think, we will do it. And we have two bashers left. So in case, I'm, in case I get kind of scary with the distance here, I can bash my way out. 
and then I can bash to the end, and then I can just blow up the guy. I really hope I didn't put my bridge too close. If not, I can just replay and do the same general strategy, because this actually worked out way better and easier than I thought it would. So, yeah, I think I'm going to have to bash my way out from right here. That will probably help immensely. And I probably need to be careful about how I build. I'll be safe as long as I make it touch and turn around. If I can make it... That is pretty nasty right there. I may have to end up building over that. I hope this only takes three bridges to get across. But, yeah, I'll probably want to build right there because... That is a nasty little gap right there. Uh-huh, that's what tells. Yes, indeed, my friends. Okay, so, I mean, this is not a bad level overall. I mean, it's kind of overwhelming at first, kind of daunting, but, uh, it's pretty easy to suss out, actually. So, let's, uh, okay, yeah, it only takes three bridges to get that hit. Take a hit of that hit. That beautiful, that beautiful acid hit. Yeah, there's no way he's walking over that. So let's go ahead and let him, uh, let's go ahead and let him build over that. Just as a contingency measure, just as insurance. So, okay, and he actually, he actually, he actually might end up, okay, this is going to get ugly, actually. Yeah, he's like right there. Okay, yeah, I had to like get that like right on. That was... Surprisingly ugly. Wow, okay, so let's blow up the blocker. I still think that's too close. I think I should have gone a little farther down the tree there. Wow, that was a... Uh, wow, any closer probably, and that would have been very dangerous. So let's get them to their exit. They're doing a uh, pretty... They're going to... They're going to squeeze into that little tight gap right there, and they're going to walk to the end. Very good, okay. Wow, that's... That's a surprisingly one-shottable level. I mean, there's a lot going on with the. There was a lot of there was a lot of time and love put into the creation of this level. Obviously, it's like its own little ecosystem. It's like its own little microcosm world, and a lot of work. It's always kind of stunning to me when so much work goes into really easy levels. I mean, it's like, it's like on the one hand, it's like, was all that work really worth it for a level that you only end up seeing for a few minutes of your life tops? But then, like, you know, you also, on the other hand, you appreciate the art, you appreciate the time that the person put into it, that they didn't just make a level that was like, oh, you go here, 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 oh, the path is very easy to sort out, you know? I ended up, I ended up looking at the landscape and really absorbing it with my face and my mind and it was it was that, that was a really cool level I, I that I think I, I I think so yeah let's go ahead and move on let's try not to uh let's try not to do like we did yesterday and uh finish with a 30 minute episode because the level I decided to end the day on ended up being ridiculous as in long not really hard but level nine be cruel with your workers no 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 we don't want no, 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 we don't we don't want OSHA having any part of this. This is this is there that's got bad news written all over it. I I guess we're going to have to be a little cruel though because we can kill up to 5 of our lemmings and we only have 2 minutes to do this. Okay, this might be where the extra levels start getting a bit gnarly. I like the inverted steel. I like the aesthetic of it right there. That's that's really cool. We got no climbers. Uh no climbers, no floaters. Um how the hell are we going to get everybody out of here? Well, we do have a release rate of 1, so we got 1, 1, 1. Okay, I think we're going to want to bash here. Uh, although, no builders or anything, nothing of the sort. Uh, this is going to be very, this is going to be very tight, because if I try to bash from, like, here, I don't think I can really bash or do anything effective there. I feel like bashing to the end is key, but if I mine here, well, I have to bash here then. It's got to it's got to be that. It's got to be that or and, and nothing else. So, I'm going to go ahead and uh let's let's see what this does. Let's see what this does. I feel I feel pretty confident that I'm going to have to bash and Okay, I think what's going to happen is I'm going to have to bash, and then I'm going to have to bomb through to release people. 
And uh, where's a good digging place? Probably like right here. Yeah, it's gonna get it's gonna get pretty messy. We're gonna have to. I think I'm gonna have to bash, bomb, dig, bomb, mine, bomb. It's good. <laughs> that's kind of an uh, that's kind of an interesting assortment. But uh, let's go ahead and uh, let's go ahead and uh, start detonating him. Yeah, right there, right now. So yeah, no, that's that's really uh, cool actually. Oh wow. Well, he's gonna die. That's unfortunate, but that's probably part of the whole one release rate type thing. Maybe I could pump it up to 10 and maybe uh, kill a few less people. Now we're going to do a uh, limbing entry Watson type of uh, trap here. Don't walk out. Over okay, good. Oh, good. He didn't walk out and over. Okay, so now I can uh, now I can get away with killing probably four... Li okay, yeah, this is going to get real messy real quick. Let's go ahead and release everybody. Wow, you got to get... You got to be quick on the <laughs> okay, so now, yeah, now we ought to be able to just, uh, now I ought to be able to just mine right here. It's got to be a really, it's got to be a really tight, yeah, there we go. And if I just mine in the right place, they should be able to walk up and be done. And that place is like right now, I think. Okay, good, I got the miner. I was afraid I was going to get the walker at some point. That is cool. I like that. They are gonna walk up over that, right? I think that's a I think that's a walkable step right there. I think that's <laughs> that was a cool level. That was really good. I like that. I like that. That would have been that would have been plenty fine in the main game. I think that was well, but it was pretty easy to solve on the other hand, because you're like once you once you figure out that you have to bomb to end each task, then it's not really it's not really uh that hard. I mean, but I <laughs> the smile on my face right now. <laughs> I just, I don't know. I got, a, I got a real thrill out of that level. But I think I'm gonna stop there for today. Uh, three levels is definitely uh, not the six that we accomplished yesterday. But I want to try to keep it nice and compact here, so we can uh, keep it rolling. And uh, that's going to do it for today. We're almost halfway through the extra levels. Uh, before you know it, we might start knocking out some of that special castle tile set. Maybe even some of those pickaxe and one type of levels. But uh, but from, from, from here on out, the order of things is going to be a little bit, uh, bit loosey-goosey and funky. Uh, but I think it'll be fun anyway. Uh, the, the, the main thing is to continue having fun. So, you know, to not, to not get into any more of these dumb little two-week droughts. So we're going we're going to try to keep the fun train rolling uh as long as we can and if we have to resort to funky order of level solving and and makeshift band-aids to do that then so be it. I will see you guys next time for uh maybe level 10 of extra, maybe level 10 of uh hurricane. Who knows what the day brings. See you guys.